everybody, it's Seth Jones, Editor-in-Chief of Golfdom Magazine. I'm out here in Kansas City, Missouri. I'm at PBI Gordon's Formulation Lab. Dr. Dale Sanson, Senior Director of Formulation Development and Compliance Chemistry, invited me to come out to see where he works and where he makes this all, all the magic happen. Dr. Dale, thanks for the invite. Thank you, Seth. So we're going to talk about T-Zone. My first question is a dumb one. Why is it called T-Zone? I guess I'll finally reveal it. T-Zone is actually, T stands for triclopyr. The active ingredient in T-Zone. And that's what adds so much power to the product. It's known for controlling those weedy nuisance weeds pests such as ground ivy, oxalis, and others. In fact, if you look at the label, there are over 60 different types of weeds that T-Zone controls. Okay. What is T-Zone? It's, so what, is, is it an SE? Is that right? Correct. Okay. SE is the nomenclature in the formulation world for accessible emulsion. What that means, it's a combination of self zone that is suspended, as well as the other components that are emulsified, to put them together as a T-Zone SE product. Okay, okay, very cool. So what about the timing for this product? When, when, when ideally are superintendents going to put this out to get the best bang for their buck? Because of the mode of action, the formulation, the weather conditions, it's probably ideal to apply uh, early spring typically April, May, that time period. Okay, and anything you wanna just brag about to me too? Any tips or tricks that you wanna really hit home with them? Um, I would say aside from the fact that it's got such power to control those woody pests, um, the easy tank mix mm -hmm. compatibility and the ease at which it goes into the spray tank. It does not need an adjuvant. However, an adjuvant will work and will not antagonize it but the formulation was designed to have all that wetting spreadability all that is in there for you as well as the active ingredients uh, plays well in the spray tank with other components uh, as i said earlier adjuvants wetting agents dyes all of that will work just fine in the spray tank with t-zone okay well doc thanks for talking to me and uh, let me know what the t stands for absolutely now we know all right Everybody, this is Dr. Dale. I'm Seth. Thanks for watching us here on Golf Team TV.